Take a very close look at the left side of your screen in the image we're showing you here. You can see a man walking out of a wooded area outside of Kay Thomason's home. This surveillance video is from the early morning hours of June 27th, the same day police found Thomason dead inside her home on Old Woodbine Road. Thomason's 2012 Kia Sorento was stolen from her home. It was found just days later at an apartment complex in Chambly. Police hope that surveillance video we just showed you, that new video, will help lead to a break in this case. Fox 5's Deidre Dukes joins us live now. And Deidre, we understand a $100,000 reward is now being offered for this case. And the victim's family joined uh, police here at Sandy Springs Police Headquarters this morning. And at that time, police did announce that the uh, reward has been increased to $100,000. We are told that police are working tirelessly in the search for the victim's killer. Now, the 71-year-old woman was found murdered in her home on Old Woodbine Road on June 27th. Today, police released video taken from Thomason's home of the suspect they are looking for. And they say that unidentified man took Thomason car. The vehicle was later located in an apartment complex in Shambly on Saturday. Now today, Thomason's daughter, joined by other family members, made an emotional plea for the public's help in the case. We're here today to ask for your help. Our mom was such a loving member of this community. Uh, for over 40 years, all of us went to school here. We know that this is a community that takes care of their neighbors. And we're asking you now to help take care of one of us, one that mattered greatly to us. Now, police telling us they are following up on leads that uh, they canvassed the area where the car was located. They are hoping that this $100,000 reward will now help generate additional leads in this case, uh, leading them to uh, the victim's killer. They are asking anyone with information in the case to contact Crime Stoppers or the Sandy Springs Police. That's the latest here in Sandy Springs. I'm Deidre Dukes, Fox 5 News. Mm, hopefully that information comes in. All right, Deidre, thank you.